assalamu alaikum viewers welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to share with you the making of high low bell sleeves it's very trendy and it looks really very nice must try it so let's get started we'll attach the bell at the lower part of the sleeve and for the top part we'll stitch the sleeve as we normally do this is the top part of the sleeve and i have stitched it all the measurements are according to the normal sleeves the cutting of the armhole and the width of the sleeve it's all normal but the length is from shoulder to elbow right mine is 13 inches so you get the top part of your sleeve ready as per your measurements so the top part is ready and now we'll attach the bell shape bottom so we'll get the bottom ready now to get the measurement of the bottom part we'll hold the measuring tape like this put the measuring tape 1 inch above the elbow and 2 or 3 inches down the wrist like this and note the measurement it's 14 inches so we'll take 1 inch extra fabric so we'll note 15 inch measurement note down this measurement we must have fabric twice this measurement right so if I get 15 inch measurement I must have 30 inch long fabric right so the fabric for one sleeve should be 30 inch long and 30 inch wide as well we need a square piece of fabric so here is the fabric I have for one sleeve it's 30 inch long and 30 inch wide now we'll fold the fabric lengthwise and widthwise so we folded it lengthwise and now we'll fold it widthwise so we get four layers of the fabric it's the closed view and this is the closed side of the fabric and we'll mark from this side from this corner for the full length of the sleeve the bottom part only so we noted 14 inch measurement so we'll mark 14 inch from this corner like this you can mark according to your measurement right from 1 inch above the elbow and 2 or 3 inches down the wrist so we'll mark it like this and we'll cut at this point so we have cut the fabric extra fabric we won't cut from this closed side right now first we'll open it but only open it half like this and fold it from one corner but we won't fold it up to the center this is the center point we'll fold it a few inches back like this so we get one short and one longer part now we'll mark at this corner for the opening to be attached to the top part so we take the top part first and we'll measure the width of the bottom it's 5 inches and it is 10 inches round so we divide 10 by 6.25 and we get 1.6 but we mark of one or two points less than the measurement we get so we'll mark at 1.4 from this corner because this is the stretch part and the top part would be straight so that's why we mark one or two points less than the measurement we get right so we'll cut at this point now we'll open it so we get one short and one longer part this is the point to be attached to the top part the side seam will be attached to the longer side of the bottom and the other part will be attached to the shorter side it is very important to mark at these points before opening the fabric so that we attach the side seam to the longer part and the other part of the sleeve to the shorter part otherwise we won't get the desired shape so we'll simply join the right sides together like this and stitch all the way around so we have sort the top part with the bottom and the side seam is attached to the longer part and the other one is attached to the shorter part this is the shape of the sleeve we got now we'll hem the bottom of the sleeve and for the circle pattern we fold the fabric once and sew all the way around then we fold once again and stitch again so we fold the fabric once and then we'll stitch it all the way around this is the easiest and the best way to stitch the fabric in circle in this way we don't get any gathers and we stitch it very easily so wherever there is a curve we put the needle in the fabric and lift up the presser foot and uh, move the fabric as required so after sewing once we'll fold the fabric again and we'll stitch it again so this is how we hem the bottom of the circle pattern whether it is a skirt or a sleeve like this or wherever we have to hem the uh, circle pattern we need to follow this method so we have hemmed the bottom you can see it's very nicely finished so now our sleeve is ready 
and it's looking really very nice and you can see the one part is shorter and it is hanging from the bottom it's the longer side must try it if you like the video give a thumbs up and if you have not subscribed our channel make sure to subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get notification on every upload and thank you so much for watching